Hello guys, uh, welcome to Tech Fidelity. My name is John Shedu Lolendo and today we are going to do a review on Vision Plus Soundbar and this is it. We have the subwoofer here and this particular bar which has four speakers, two on this side, two on the other side and let's look at what it, what's in the box. So the subwoofer comes in this particular box and it comes with a remote uh, and the bar comes in this particular box as well. I, I, I really have a problem with this particular kind of packaging. I feel it becomes a little bit more fragile because it came attached just like this. It would have been best if they came up with a new uh, product uh, packaging design which would have accommodated all this equipment in one particular box. But this kind of uh, packaging makes it a little bit more fragile but luckily enough it got here in good shape and so this is what comes in the box as usual it has a warranty card uh, yeah. Just a moment. it comes with two warranties one for you as the customer another one for the seller uh, another thing is the manual for which can enable you to actually set up the soundbar it also comes with uh, an auxiliary cable uh, another thing that comes in it is this grip and uh, a grip for, for the soundbar and another screw as well as an attachment for for mounting the particular bar on the wall. So that's an added advantage. You can actually mount this bar on the wall alongside your TV to at least have an appealing uh, look. And this one here can be placed under your your soundbar. This one can be placed under your soundbar so that it reduces the movement of, of the music system during loud volumes. So yeah. There are two. One can be placed on one side, another on another end. So let's just have a look at the product itself. This here is the remote for the soundbar. It has quite a lot of buttons, uh, numbers which can enable you to choose from one radio channel to another. The volume up, volume down, the reset button, the bass plus and bass minus, uh, the channel changing from one channel to another. Yeah, and forwarding, backwards, pause, play, stop. 
Uh, we have the Bluetooth there. We have the FM radio. We have the USB capability. We also have the aux auxiliary compartment. We also have the power on button and selecting from one input to another. So yeah, let's get to its charger. So yeah, it comes with this particular charger. Very nice actually. I noticed that it can actually charge my laptop. So this is actually another advantage to me. Yeah, it has an adapter as well as the charging input here. So yeah, it goes So let's get it started and see how it actually performs. You connect the charger on this particular port. Then you take this wire that comes from the subwoofer and place it on the yellow compartment here. Written sub out. Yeah. You can actually control the sound by using the buttons that are right above it here. Uh, by clicking the mode it can get powered on so just get it like that and it goes straight to auxiliary mode and you can change from one mode to another so let's say we change it to the bluetooth mode and that's it and it gets connected to a pairable device so the name of this soundbar on on the TV is coded as VP 2110SB in brackets 9F colon 60 closed colon. So yeah, you connect it with your TV or your phone and that's it. So you can actually play music and it has a maximum volume of 30 a base uh, level of 30 I didn't see it having treble one thing that I did not notice in previous uh, reviews from other customers who happened to have bought this particular soundbar in in its initial launch they noted that it has a poor base which after talking to the vision plus representative told me that this particular design is an upgraded version which has better better bass and better better sound it's it's very crisp and very very clear that's the good thing i, I liked about this particular model of the soundbar and considering the price point it comes at around 7500 kenyan shillings which is 75 dollars in the u.s currency i think yeah, this is actually a, a good bargain. Yeah, most soundbars come at around uh, $200, which is ultimately 20,000 shillings in the Kenyan currency and above. But getting a soundbar at this price and of such quality is really impressive. Uh, let's just take a test of the sound and clarity and you'll be the judge of it. see that's what we have that is the actual full volume it's really impressive it's loud <laughs> that's all I can say I can't even talk when it's playing music so and when it comes to movies it's it's really impressive on how it actually plays out with the clarity of the voice of your actors and the background music such as SFX and uh, soundtracks that are always in the background so yeah this is just what the soundbar is all about you can actually use it for your radio you can use it for uh, your what is it called your memory card you can use it for your USB desk you can use an auxiliary cable for it where you can play music from your phone or your TV using the auxiliary cord. Yeah, and also it comes with Bluetooth. Most uh, sound systems nowadays don't have Bluetooth, I don't know why, but having 
a sound system like this from Vision Plus. Uh, the synchronization between Vision Plus products, its soundbar and its TV, really impressive. I'm having very impressive results. So that's what you've seen from Vision Plus soundbar. I would really urge that you subscribe to my YouTube channel and wait for more content that I'll be uploading. Otherwise, that's it for now. Thanks and let's wait for the next one. Peace.